Hi, this is Keith Furrow. I wanted today to talk to you about new construction. What separates one builder from another? A lot of times people see uh, commercials or advertisements and really low price and they're trying to figure out, well, why is this one builder this price? And then they drive over the uh, down the road and there's another builder and, you know, looks nice, but uh, he has a different price. And what determines that? Now, the three main things that determine that are uh, the land cost because the size of the land and location, how close it is to um, the water, how close it is to a highway, that would be one thing. The type of homes that they build the shapes and you know if it's in a subdivision or you know a community that's uh, protected or gated and then you have what features do you know what do they do they offer modern features or more of the old-fashioned features and you know how exactly is all that put together and the next three things that determine that uh, the value is you know each builder has his own opinion of what's best and there's basically five things that separate builders. First thing is this floor plans. Floor plans are usually copyrighted and they're the particular intellectual property of the builder. It's a, it's a property or a floor plan that he has determined or she has determined that fits the market and it's the right shape and there's a large demand. And most builders have two, three, four floor plans that they may have 15 or 20 in their repertoire, but two, three, four is what they sell most often. The next thing that would be that separates them is the supplies. What materials? Are they doing the cheapest material the code will allow? Are they doing fancier, more upgraded material? Those things really matter. And then you've got the supervision. Are, is the uh, person that's putting them together, are they very experienced? Have they built a lot of homes, a few homes? Because it's going to make a big difference because, you know, a lot of people can build a home, but bringing a home together and putting the parts together, making it uh, work well together and look good is not an easy task. And then you've got the suppliers. You've got different subcontracts and suppliers. Uh, some of them have more experience than others. Some of them are the cheaper ones, some of the more expensive ones. You know, when you look at your home, um, a lot of times, in my opinion, it's better to spend a little bit more money to, to have the quality. And then the last thing that would separate builders from another is their reputation. You know, builders have different reputations. They have different experience. Some have built 20 homes, some have built two homes, and some have built, some have built thousands of homes. In our current market here in the Woodlawn Beach area, our price range on new probably run from about 110 to 150 or 60 a square foot. But one thing about square footage price that I always tell people, it's kind of like what does a four-door car cost? You can have everything from a $10,000 four-door car or you can have a $200,000 four-door car. All of them have a steering wheel, all of them have wheels, all of them have an engine, but they're, they're different, drastically different. Same thing when it comes to a house. That's what separates one house from another, one builder from another. This is Keith Farrell, Keith Farrell Associates. Give us a call and we'd be glad to explain and uh, show you our details. Thank you.